cachexia is a situation where patients you lose uh, greater than 10% of their muscle mass and or fat mass and this is also associated with functional declines and it really puts a patient at high risk um, for dose reductions. It creates poor prognosis in terms of their cancer outcome. It's a real problem. Um, it's also very closely associated with fatigue. So when we see cachexia, we see a lot of severe fatigue. And more recently, um, there have been uh, studies that have come out to suggest that there's a clear role for the use of exercise in helping to treat the cachexia and fatigue. And so one thing that's really important for cancer patients to think about, and, and their care providers already know this, is that it's simply not enough these days to give a patient an agent that may in fact uh, hold their body mass stable. So maybe it maintains lean mass and fat mass and it keeps your weight more stable. However, you still are severely fatigued and you still, have, uh, you still struggle with functional impairment and inability to do your activities of daily living. So it could be that what we're going to see in the future as some of the most promising ways to treat cachexia is that we will marry some very promising pharmaceutical agents uh, with exercise interventions so that we can stabilize the body mass, the lean mass and the fat mass, prevent the weight loss and weight reduction, and then we can also maintain and or improve the physical function and reduce the fatigue.